welcome back to the session as you can see I got the uh, handy dandy cold season backpack you know what I'm saying got my car seat in the back because you know what I'm saying I got kids but hey it's a beautiful day now I told you guys we were gonna get interviews in we're gonna have an interview today you know what I'm saying the first one so it, it'll be cool I got a script already ready <clears throat> and the idea here is I'm gonna pretty much use the exact script for every single person that I interview. And even still, you'll see how different the interviews will be. So I'll use the same script, basically asking the same exact questions, but the flow and everything, the energy, it'll just be different with each and every person. And uh, you, you might learn something from that. So it might take 10, 15, maybe 20 interviews that we do for, you know what I'm saying? Not necessarily a pattern, but for you to kind of get a correlation or a idea on how, you know what I'm saying? On how the vibe went or I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's hard to explain. Put it like that. But I think it'll be interesting I think it'll be interesting to see, you know what I'm saying, how these interviews play out, because some interviews may be trash, some may be fucking really good, and I ask the same questions to each person, you know what I'm saying, it depends on what type of answer they give me, you know what I'm saying, if they're going to be short, or if they're going to give a detailed answer, you know what I'm saying, if they're coming in with energy, or are they coming in with no energy at all, just lackluster, so we'll see. You know what I'm saying? We'll see who's vibing with the, the ice cold man. You know what I'm saying? I love talking the joint out when I'm fucking talking to you motherfuckers on YouTube. But hey, this is the motherfucking session. So we can do whatever we want. But yeah, we're getting the first interview in today. It should be, it'll, it'll be nice, you know what I'm saying? I, t I told you guys already, you know what I'm saying? I want to interview people that haven't necessarily made it yet, but are damn near on the come up, and they will be famous one day. They'll create something. They'll create something dope, you know what I'm saying? Just, just give y'all, you know what I'm saying, another look at other people's work out here, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people... There's a lot of people out here that are doing some dope shit, but they don't really have an outlet or a platform. You know what I'm saying? Pushing their shit or whatever so that, you know what I'm saying, they could get discovered. Now, I know we don't got millions of followers, but you know what I'm saying? Just for us to be an outlet to help, you know what I'm saying? Some hidden talent get discovered. You know what I'm saying? We're here to capture that and uh capture the moments here on the session because i got visions of my own and you know what i'm saying in the future you know what i'm saying things will be very great so i know the groundwork and everything here right now this shit is fucking priceless but it's good you know what i'm saying i don't have nothing to worry about and neither should you because you should be focused putting in the work staying on the grind and if you do those things you'll get to where you want to get to i truly believe that put all faith and all your trust into god the father give thanks to lord jesus for his sacrifice you know i'll, I'll even start it off thank you lord jesus for your sacrifice and everything you've done for me and my family you know what i'm saying you have to you have to do those things you know and you have to mean it and believe it when you do say it but hey you know and don't listen to those people out there oh how can you talk about god and smoke weed you know don't listen to those type of people because they're just you know they're sinners they're sinners of their own so you don't necessarily have to even 
pay attention to those type of people. There's nowhere in the Bible does it say don't smoke marijuana. Nowhere. Be sober minded. It does say that. So, you know what I'm saying? If you were a little boy and you got little baby lungs and if you smoke weed, you can't, you know what I'm saying? You're not sober minded, then yeah, don't smoke no weed. But, you know what I'm saying? If weed doesn't affect you that way, and if you know, you know, then you know. But if you don't, then it's fine. So, you don't have to worry about nothing nobody's saying give thanks to god the father give thanks to the lord jesus and he will forgive you for your sins period point blank now let's get back to work you know we're gonna get these interviews in for you guys you know what i'm saying and it's gonna be gravy we're doing the first one tonight hopefully you know what i'm saying i don't know if i'll be able to edit it tonight depending on what time and shit what time I get back from uh, working and all that shit so we'll see but you know what I'm saying I'll get the interview out ASAP but yeah we're gonna keep working we're gonna keep grinding y'all got business plans today what are y'all doing today you know what i'm saying let me know in the comments you gotta put the work in man you gotta grind you gotta go after it that's what i do know is the motherfucking session so if you are smoking along just make sure you ain't using no tobacco products I don't fuck with tobacco so you shouldn't either it's terrible for you this right here this is a raw paper completely organic baby saying do your research and this is a raw organic black you know i i don't i don't do the classics only smoke you know what i'm saying the raw blacks or excuse me the raw black is the classic i don't smoke the originals the raw originals Or the cones. I haven't really smoked no cones either in a very long time. I just been straight raw black paper. You know what I'm saying? No filter, no nothing. Cause I use, I only smoke Nolo basically. Yeah, I only smoke by myself. If I do smoke with other people, or like if I smoke with my brother or one of the homies or something, we'll just each have our own joint. You know what I'm saying? And we're just smoking right next to each other type shit. I don't really like to, you know what I'm saying, do the passing of shit around, you know what I'm saying? That's what children do, you know? That's just our preference, you know? We, If we about to have a smoke session, you know I'm saying the homies get together after not seeing each other for how long, you know what I'm saying? And motherfuckers is outside and you happen to got a couple in session and you pass them around. And, All right, yeah, that's okay. You know what I'm saying? But that's not an everyday thing. That's not, that's like a once a year. I mean, like, you know what I'm saying? You just don't, that's shit, just passing that shit around is whack. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna smoke, you know what I'm saying? We'll just roll up. Let's just roll up a joint and fucking smoke it. But the grind is inevitable when you know your destination. You know where you gotta get to? 
nothing's gonna stop you from getting there. If you know your destination, what's gonna stop you from getting there? You gotta get up and get after it. Because if you just sit at home, you'll never take off. You gotta get up, get after it, and get to work. Don't think about results for the first two, three months. Just work, just grind. You could do that, and get in the routine, you'll be fucking unstoppable. Fucking believe that. So get to work, keep grinding. Turn this video off and go get some work in. I'ma see y'all.